Okay, that's the same for the capture gallery, so off we go again. Good morning ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the next uh, uh, society event for um, PGA 2K21. How this is a different society that we're playing the first round for today. Uh, this is early 1981's World of Golf. Um, ran by Lee Walker. So um, this is the one we're going to be playing for today. Got my entry requirement, which is fine. Right, he's not. Right. So, have they left the. Uh, driver which will give us uh, more of a swing plane that's the one right. the rest of them are fine so that's no problem and that's the one we're going with now we can should change it over. So we've done that. So we've got that and that uh, takes place at Twin Fish Twin Cities, okay. And off we go. Now have you left the timing open? That's what we need to know. Current from twenty five, I can enter that event. And get okay. This time we should have both the uh, front nine and the back nine in this video, ladies and gentlemen. We can have a remember to restart the video before starting video clip on the PS4 before starting the round. Hello so there we and welcome to this society event. event. We are teeing it up today yeah. on the first hole of TPC Twin Cities. Let's start this round with a bang. Put that one out there in the fairway. Just hook, hook on, on to this, this one. one. And that's why I told him to do it. Okay, we're in the deep rough. Careful. Not too bad, though. Good stuff. Sink this and you'll pull down a birdie. Oh, that was a zip right by, didn't it? And uh, that will be your par putt here. Better putt this time, but the way up the line. 
A little too hard. Okay, let's see what you can do with this seven footer. This one's tracking. Nice putt there. And off to a bit of a slow start after that first hole. We're over par, but don't worry. I have faith. Yeah, you might need a little more power. We've got a headwind on this hole. Should be smooth sailing off the tee. And this is around the uh, 190 mark. Well, might not like the results here. And that approach was a bit wayward. Okay, third shot. Hard enough to fly. And you've got, you got this, this left for par on this one. All right, putting uh, here for bogey. That one goes down, and that's for a bogey. And uh, that's back to back bogeys. And you are currently two over. See what happens here. We get a long par four for this one. Oh, effortlessly done. Nice swing. We're about 205 yards out from here. Well, you can't hit them all. And this is our third shot. Oh, look at here. Nice chip. Okay, time to finish up on this one. All right, let's see what's happening elsewhere on the leaderboard. Okay, so that'll keep you at two over for the round. All right, see if you can get this close to the pin here. Not be a, a little wayward on that approach. And second shot here on the fourth. That sort of line should not be penalized. Here is a 12 footer. To get a straight line, you should. Difficult doing it. This is your bogey pot. Oh, that'll, that'll do just nice. Currently sitting at three over par. We've got a left to right breeze on this hole. There's something off on that swing. I just can't, can't figure out what. And second shot here on the fifth. I know what's up on it. Well, you're not going to hit every green today. That's all right. Timing. And this is your third shot. Swing timing. It's a little bit off. That was good. Wouldn't that be nice to save par on this one? It's getting there. Good job. We're in par. Okay, so that'll keep you at three over for the round. And here we go with a par five. I don't know how many rounds this event is. It's a little bit fast. This could roll into the rough, I think. Okay, second shot on the sixth. That's it. Not quite as bad. This is what our third shot's looking like. Just trying to find the middle of the plane at the moment. It's tidy. And about 14 feet to go. Get in there. This one's for par. Mm. 
There we go. And right now, you are sitting at three over par. Still three over. Wind picked up here, blowing right to left. Should be totally. Just a pure swing. Nothing wrong with his driving. And here's our second shot on the seventh. The driver's working. Oh, that almost went down. Three feet to go. And yes, the birdie will count. Two over. And right now you are two over par. Moving up that leaderboard, he's in fifth at the moment. There's only five people that complete in the round. Well, you can't hit all the greens. Second shot here on hole number eight. Something was wrong there. It should have. Yeah, you think this, you could save par. Just overhead. Ooh, close. This one's a three foot putt. Good putt in there for the bogey. Currently three over par for the day. Here we go. Teeing this one up on the ninth hole. Should be down there and it can keep the line. That'll do nicely. And we're about at, I don't know, 200 yards or so from the pin from here. For the pin. Yeah, this one might be a bit long. That one, uh, yeah, that's in the water. All right, this is your fourth shot. He needs a bigger plane for those iron shots. I'll see you later to that ball. Yeah, yeah, lining up your sixth shot plane. here. Portland. Definitely needs a bigger plane. And this, this one will, will be for, for double, double bogey. bogey. Unfortunately, he's struggling with his timing. Bit long on that one. Four feet to go. Oh man. So the window is. So and no just need. pop this one in for the quad bogey and just get the heck out of here. All right, let's get to the next. And you're currently seven over. Well, let's see if you can use the tailwind on this hole. All right, second shot on the tenth. All right, staring down a birdie pot here. Wait. Quite on Yikes. the line. Right by, right by the hole. Yeah, give this one a tap and we will mosey on our way. All right, see what the scorecard says. Okay, so that'll keep you at seven over for the round. Here comes the 11th hole. It didn't feel as clean as I know you can hit it. Setting up from the long grass here. Let's get on out of this. Took his time there. I think you can probably two putt from here. 29 feet to go. Good line. Sorry, good weight. Well, that was tough. Uh, a, little bit, a little bit too hard on that one. Here we go. This is for par. Yeah. Very, very setting up here for the bogey. Sure okay, let's see what the next hole has for us. 
Currently eight over on the day. Here's a par five. Let's see what you can do with it. Price. Nice, pure swing. Great stuff. All right, second shot on the 12th. as fast as it has been. That's bold, using the driver off the fairway. I'll, I'll take it. I'm sure you didn't plan that one. That's not going to be good. Setting up here now for our third shot. Yeah, he was trying to. The swing was a little off kilter. Ah. Oh. And what are you thinking? What are you thinking out of this fairway bunker? Let's see what you got. And from 23 feet away. I understand now it's a big fast. Yeah. This one's just three feet. And as that putt drops, that's a second bogey in a row. Let's turn things around. And currently sitting at nine over. He's blowing left to right on this one. This is a non-timed difficult swing. Come on, kick to the right. All right, here's our second shot on the 13th. And this will save your par. This putt's tracking. Nice stroke on that one. Okay, so that's going to keep you at nine over for the round. Ooh, there's a slice. Big, big slice. This is out of the second cut here. Okay, back on the fairway. Let's see if we can hit that green now. This one's your third. Okay, 13 feet to the hole. Going towards that hole. All right, nice little two foot putt. Okay, let's head to the next. And now sitting at 10 over for your round. And teeing up now on the 15th hole. That's his show above 10 over. Nine. Oh, that one is sliced. It should be showing above nine. Be careful with this one. We're in the deep stuff. Going through some leaves. All right, back in the fairway. I'm liking that. Setting up for our third shot. This next putt for par. This one's on a good line. Three feet left. And that's too bad, a bit of bad luck here. That is your second bogey in a row. Sitting at 11 over for the round. Nice. We've got a nice tailwind on this hole. See what you can do with that. Oh my, you fucked this one. Setting up in the bunker. I'm surprised I'm getting that big a hook on the drive. Okay, good stuff. Back into the fairway. This is our third shot. And this one to save par. Oh, this one's for the Bogue. Okay, let's take a look at the big picture. Let's check the leaderboard. Sitting at 12 over. Struggling a bit. 
Here we go. Hole number 17, ready to go. Your approach is heading a little leftward. Don't get down on yourself. Coming off a string of uh, three bogeys in a row, but I think we can turn things around here. And with this pot, you can save par. Good luck. Close. Okay, this left for bogey. Let's we'll see how see that all adds, adds up. up. 13 over, over for this round. 18th, 18th hole, hole coming up, up, and then you can hang in the clubhouse. Let's see what you can do here. That was powerful. And we are in the deep stuff currently. Let's get out of here now. All right, we're back in the fairway. That's great news. Okay, third shot. I'm just wondering if you can take a lot of time with this. Yeah, it seems like you can take a lot of time with it. I don't think this is going to be good. This one's in fourth. Oh, yeah, stuck it close from the trap. Well done. And the par putt drops. Lovely way to end your round, I think. Yeah, it seems that you can take. Okay, 13 over par at the end of all this today. And with that, I will leave you with this. My heartfelt gratitude for picking the game up in the first place. And thanks. So that didn't go very well, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully, event two, now that I know about timing and you can. The fact you can hold it a little bit longer to get the less of the fast, I should be able to pick things up for round two. Now, No doubt the timing the timing should be like that should be altered. There's no doubt about that. But what I want to do is I will make sure that I play play again. Okay, so 13 over, so I struggled there. Um, I don't have to play any more rounds for that event. That event is done. Um, that is the end of the first event, which is close. Now, if I was to do one, then, uh, then I would open it up. Uh, but... Um, also means I can switch back to my, my own setting which should be held up in the game so it should already know what my settings are it just changes them for when you're playing in a society round so there's my there's my settings that it knows that I want to use so that's fine 634 and that's good right. now
now then. Um, let's go into, let's see if they've, Have they changed the way this works? No, I don't think so. so. Right, okay, so the good old course designer that you expect, okay. Right. So. I think we need to get some bigger How much are them tall sevens? How much are they? check them to sevens because I need to change the headset. Yeah, you can see that uh, this is those ones. Even the P790 would be better. They're 1200, okay. Right, so they're 1200. So, one, one, two, three, it'd get you there. Nine or something. I know it's three ninety nine for the first one. It's sixteen quid for the other one. Right, okay. That's not worth it then. Right, two thousand three hundred is what you need to get those. Those will give you slightly less distance, but a much better, well, not a much better. Um, the, the, the Callaway Maverick Pro isn't bad either, but has a much less swing plane, so it's the swing plane that we need. Um, P790, the Wilson Star. Sim Max Zero Sum Probably Junior. Okay, so you need basically, but that gives you a bigger swing plane on the iron. That you need to basically give you, uh, give yourself. Now, the P790 
Bridgestone sponsor award. So that's what you need to work with. You need to work with Bridgestone on the contracts for the previous tour. And that way you can do that. Right, previous tour career. I don't know if I'm under contract at the moment by anybody. Who am I in to, who am I under contract with? Nah. Taylor made it, so when this contract ends, you need to go to Bridgestone and work at it. That's going to end this video, ladies and gentlemen. And as always, thank you for your support and thanks for watching.